Hello, so we're here with our Crystals and Chakras series where you find soul healing if needed, consciousness expansion, and the joy of life. And today we're going to talk about optical calcite or clear calcite. It has a few different names, mostly because of the way it's cut and how it's been used in history, especially with navigation in ancient times. So it has different names, but we're going to call this clear calcite or optical calcite. And it aligns the crown chakra. It's a beautiful, very, very powerful stone. There really are no words to describe how much this crystal can help us in our lives, but I'll I'll make it, I'll give you it a try, right? I'll, I'll tell you all the benefits that I've learned from this stone in my, in my path and my research and how I've observed how it works. So taking very deep breaths now, there's a general attribute of the stone, which is about new beginnings. This is very, very, very powerful. So as you dive into yourself and you feel that you need to change things in your life, clear calcite is going to help you with that. So new beginnings mean that there are things in our lives that are either obsolete, that were necessary temporarily, but should not stay in our lives. Otherwise, they create comfort zones and stagnation. But it can be a real temptation to stay in that place. And life will, if you decide to stay in a stagnant place or in the wrong direction or, you know, just plateau in one of the steps of your life and not grow and not move forward, life is going to nudge you to do that. And if you do it on your own, if you feel it, if you sense that it's time and you listen to your heart and follow your truth, you will truly understand that it's time for, for things to change. So new beginnings is the, the beautiful general attribute of optical calcite or clear calcite. The emotional benefits are many, but the first one that I will start talking about is actually unfolding from new beginnings, which is that it promotes huge shifts, not tiny little adjustments, not fine tuning, but actual structural shifts in your life. And it really gets you out of your comfort zone, not in a traumatic way, but in a dynamic and joyful way. But still, it's all about promoting big shifts that you know you need to make in your life, right? So it also helps a lot emotionally with self-permission to two specific things. We need self-permission for a lot of things, but when it comes to optical calcite or clear calcite, it's a self-permission for change and expansion. You know, sometimes we change to make our lives small. Sometimes if the ego or the inner child are ruling our lives, we may self-sabotage and make our lives worse the change is not good. And that's not what optical calcite is going to promote. On the contrary, it's going to encourage you to promote huge shifts for growth and happiness and joy and expansion. So self-permission to change, even if you have to dive into the unknown, which is always what change encompasses, right? But it is for growth and expansion. And we need to allow ourselves give ourselves permission to grow and expand. So that's another emotional benefit that clear calcite brings to your life. Another one is that it deeply heals the soul. This is really one of the most powerful crystals for soul healing. I keep saying soul healing if needed, consciousness expansion always, and the joy of life always, right? But when it comes to soul healing, which many of us need, sometimes really desperately. It is one of the most powerful stones for soul healing in general. It really aligns the crown chakra and it, it promotes something that the crown chakra really governs and rules all the other chakras, the lower chakras. So it's such an aligner of energy. And when it, it's about soul healing, it is about consciousness expansion in a spiritual way. So it just really helps promote that. And emotionally, it's also a great stone to help reduce tension. 
especially tension in general, but especially when it means that you have to say something that is not going to be what the other person wants to hear, but it is the truth that creates healthy boundaries for you. So maybe it's about communicating something that will not be ideal for someone else. Maybe someone else is requiring something that really benefits them out of you. And if you if it makes sense for you emotionally, if you do it with an open heart, it's wonderful. It's a win-win situation. But if someone requires something of you that will benefit them for sure, and you don't want to do it, you displease yourself and you do it just to please the other person. This can be subtle or it can be really obvious. You have to stop doing that. And and clear calcite is really going to, to bring the awareness and the emotional strength for you to displease someone in the name of your truth, in the name of pleasing yourself, choosing yourself instead of pleasing others. This is emotional maturity too, right? So it is, it helps re- and it reduces the tension of that. The person will not feel, you know, angry or sad or mad. They will understand. It, it really communicates higher consciousness both ways. And you will not feel tense to communicate something that may displease the other person or may have to set boundaries. You will, you will feel light about it. It reduces tension in this kind of situation. And it also is a stone that cuts the drama. This is awesome. Emotionally, not only will you not feel inclined to amplify things and be dramatic, but you will sense when drama is starting to build up in a situation or someone, a person in your life, a close person is engaging in drama you will sense it and you will take the initiative not to allow it to grow in a very, very subtle way. It, it, as I said, it reduces tension and it cuts the drama at the same time. So it's a wonderful stone in that kind of situation, right? It also, and this is powerful. It is, it, this is a beautiful, amazing stone. It is a soul healing stone. And also it's a stone that truly connects you to the core of your being and encourages you to honor your truth. So you see the truth, you honor the truth, and you express the truth. This is emotional too. It's an emotional benefit, a triple emotional benefit. You see the truth with your third eye. You honor the truth in your heart and you speak it up and you speak it up. You express it with the the throat chakra power, right? So It's just amazing when you can do that. And again, another emotional benefit that unfolds from honoring your truth is the emotional self-permission not to be perfect. So you start ditching the idealized self-image, the need to be perfect. It's an idealized self-image and it's also a people pleaser kind of mechanism that you just allow to dissolve emotionally. So you allow yourself not to be perfect anymore. You dissolve your idealized self-image and this brings so much emotional relief, right? So beautiful benefits. When it comes to the mental benefits of clear calcite, there are many too. And again, these are all very deep. The first one I would say is the mirror understanding, meaning You understand that the outside world is a mirror image of your inner world. Whatever situation you're going through is just consciousness showing you the state of your soul, the state of your being within. So when you understand that, you start working on yourself and you know that the more you work on yourself, the more your outside world life will improve, right? So you stop being a victim, you stop being a martyr, you stop blaming others, you stop giving others the power of your life. You stop giving away your power to other people because you know they're just messengers of consciousness to tell you about the state of your inner world. So a mind that has this mirror understanding is a very sophisticated mind. Optical calcite, clear calcite, is 
a sophisticated stone. It really will sophisticate your energy, heighten it, polish it. It's beautiful. So still on a mental level, again, this is almost kind of obvious. It's a stone that helps you see clearly. It's a mind that sees clearly. So it's great to release confusion, right? If you see clearly, you're not confused. And it's also a stone of higher consciousness perception. You don't perceive just with mundane eyes. You perceive with spiritual eyes. You perceive reality with a higher consciousness. And it really helps to sharpen psychic abilities and to own psychic abilities. So when people are sensitive, some religions call this mediumship. But it, it really boils down to healing abilities and psychic abilities. The same person may have both. More psychic, less healing. More healing, less psychic. Both heightened. Each person is different. But there are people who have this kind of sensitivity, who are born with healing and psychic abilities. Optical calcite, clear calcite, is going to address psychic abilities okay really heighten them and organize them because you don't want to have heightened psychic abilities without the proper training without the proper support without understanding what's happening so optical calcite is going to help you develop psychic abilities in a very organized and very non-tense way it's not going to be stressful Okay, it's about owning them, acknowledging them. You, you know that this is a stone that helps you see the truth and honor it, right? And, and develop your psychic abilities in a very healthy, in a very aligned way. Also still in the mental benefits uh, area, I would say that because, and this has to do with the way that sometimes, that often it's cut, and one of the reasons why clear calcite is called optical calcite, it's the way it refracts light, and this specific shape helps you see, it's like double images, right? So your mind is able to see what, I'm not going to get into the technical details of this because it may be distracting, it's distractive, it will bring distraction to soul healing, consciousness expansion, and the joy of life that crystals bring in the series, but... On a mental level, this is a stone that helps see double-sided meanings in any kind of communication. The double meaning behind words. You start to perceive that with more clarity. So it helps with manipulation. It also helps with enigmas, with mysterious messages. Oracles sometimes have so much meaning behind the words right? You need to go more in depth. And it's not about, it's really about when it comes to oracles, not interpreting that according to what you want, but interpreting an oracle according to the truth, which may not be what your ego wants or what your inner child wants, right? So it really is about that connection with a clear truth and with a clear mind. Beautiful, right? So many benefits of optical, optical calcite, clear calcite as you can see. Physical benefits of the stone, well, it's very well known in the crystal world as a cure-all crystal, and it really is. And this has this has background to it. Remember that it is it's a crown chakra stone. And it aligns the crown chakra in a specific natural attribute of the crown chakra, which is to trickle down to all the cells of the body. So of course it's going to help you cure anything because when you cure and align and integrate all the cells of the body, you are in perfect health. So it's there's a, a logical explanation to that. And it really helps to remove stagnant energy. So on a physical level, not just in the body, also in the environment, but in the body, stagnant energy like tumors or clots, anything that's stagnant, it doesn't have to be serious. It could be even aesthetic, like um, anything in the body that you don't really like, maybe excessive fat or cellulite. Not that you should be focusing too much on your body image, but in your body's health and in the expression of your best self, right? So anything that's stagnant and that you don't really 
want in your body. No one wants stagnant energy in the body. It's not healthy. So optical calcite, clear calcite is going to help with that. Any stagnant energy. Also in the environment, too many objects, obsolete objects, obsolete information, anything that is that was important in a period of, of your life, but it's not important anymore. You don't want to be holding on to that. You don't want to be holding on to all your childhood notebooks, for example, right? If it's important to you, it makes sense, yes, but sometimes we are just hoarding the past with material things that could be making space for the future to come into your lives, your life, right? So our lives. So I want you to understand that this is a stone that will encourage you to spring clean, that the environment be in full vitality and not cluttered with unnecessary energy, your body and your environment. Physically, it's also one of the best stones possible for the physical eyes, not just the third eye, not just the subtle eyes, but also the physical eyes. Anything regarding the eyes on a physical level will be benefited if you use clear calcite for it. And it's wonderful on the physical level for the body for all elimination processes, anything, sweat, urine, anything that you that eliminates in the body is benefited by clear calcite, big time. Because it aligns the crown chakra, it aligns all the chakras. It also enhances this crown chakra attribute, right? Because when the, the crown chakra is active and all the chakras are connected, the crown chakra can rule your life. It really is a metaphor of your higher self ruling your life and all the levels of consciousness that pertain to the chakras are benefited by that. So it's a great all chakras aligner. And when it comes to elimination processes in our lives, back to that a little bit, and, and why this is a physical thing more than anything else, there are ways to eliminate things in your life, unnecessary things. You can cut them, you can purify them, you can transmute them. Optical calcite, clear calcite, is a stone that is connected to purification. So you will discard what doesn't serve you and keep, you, keep what serves you, okay? So it's a purification stone. For the body and for the environment, it purifies, it revitalizes at the same time, because again, it aligns the crown chakra. It's a revitalizer. Your body will feel more vitality. It's a detox stone as well, right? Purification and detox are almost the same thing. And it really elevates the vibrations. It's one of the most high vibrational frequency crystals ever. So it revitalizes, it purifies, it detoxes, and it elevates the vibrations of your body and of the environment on a physical level, which is beautiful right? So as I always say, the spiritual benefit, the essence of the crystal is where it's the source of all the other benefits, right? And we should not take this lightly because clear calcite is all about enlightenment. There are many people who dedicate their whole lives and many, many lifetimes to finding enlightenment in a human experience self-realization. And this is the potential of optical calcite. It really encourages enlightenment, connection with higher consciousness, sharing higher consciousness with source, God. Beautiful, right? So it is a very powerful spiritual benefit. And as I always say, the theory is important. It organizes our ideas. It elevates and expands our consciousness. Our experience with crystals is so much richer because we have all the theory behind us, the background, right? The theoretical um, structure that animates our connection with the stones is way deeper and more expanded and beautiful. So it makes a whole difference in our lives when we understand everything behind the crystal. But, and you really don't have to have the physical stone to benefit from the consciousness of the crystal. Just visualizing its blueprint and just knowing what the crystal brings to your life is enough. 
But in a human experience in 3D mode, right, in the physical realm, if you want to have a whole, full, complete experience with a crystal, you can have the physical being. And there are always three practices that I suggest. So when it comes to optical calcite or clear calcite, I suggest three practices. And the first one, that is by far the most important one, I, I would say is to place it on your third eye. And this is going to clear your mind, connect the third eye to the crown chakra, allow the crown, allow the crown chakra to permeate the third eye, release limiting beliefs, purify the mind. And you only need three minutes for that. So lie down, place a clear calcite on your third eye, and for three minutes, just allow it to act, and it's beautiful. Calcites are pretty dynamic crystals. They work really fast. You don't need more than three minutes for this practice, okay? The second one is to place optical calcite above your head. So you want to lie down for this too. So you can place it above your head on a pillow if you're on the floor. Just place it above your head. It's going to activate your eighth chakra. There's so many names for the chakras, right? In different spiritual systems. Um, your soul star above the crown chakra for higher consciousness connection. So this enhances and expands your higher consciousness and stimulates enlightenment. Often I do this in a row. First, I do the third eye practice, three minutes, and then I place optical calcite above my head and do three minutes of the higher consciousness practice. Sometimes it's just third eye. Sometimes it's just above the head. Your intuition will guide you. There's no rule for that, okay? Just feel inspired. Just connect to the crystals and let them speak to you. And the third and last practice that I suggest is to have it in your environment. Optical calcite in your environment is amazing. It really purifies the environment as a whole. It benefits your whole body. Your subtle bodies will feel the vibration. It's really wonderful and so powerful. Okay? So this is what I wanted to share with you today. I hope it was clear that it brings you joy, that it brings you wonderful things, and I will see you soon.